what could be hope for those who lost millions in the Bernie Madoff Ponzi scheme, a big settlement today. It was reached with the estate of one of the disgraced financier's biggest clients, a Palm Beach billionaire. Good afternoon, everyone. $7.2 billion. That's the amount the estate of Palm Beach philanthropist Jeffrey Pickauer will pay back to the victims of Bernie Madoff. It's the largest forfeiture in the history of the country through the Department of Justice, um, which I think is only uh, fitting as an offset to the greatest and most epic fraud in history. Pickhauer was one of Bernie Madoff's oldest clients. The money given back today represents the amount Pickhauer made off Madoff's Ponzi scheme during nearly 35 years of investing. This settlement provides a significant measure of hope for the many victims of Bernard Madoff's horrific crimes. Dick Hour died in 2009 in the swimming pool of his Palm Beach mansion. In a statement through her lawyer, his wife says Dick Hour was not involved in Madoff's fraud, but that giving back the money was, quote, the right thing to do. A good step forward for those trying to recover all they lost in Madoff's scheme. Already, the government has auctioned off all of Madoff's assets, including homes in Palm Beach, the Hamptons, and a New York City apartment all to try to pay back duped investors. But it is still not enough. With close to $10 billion now recovered, we have together collected close to 50% of the principal that victims lost to Madoff's Ponzi scheme. A scheme that continues to hurt those who trusted just one. The settlement with the estate of Pickhauer was detailed today in Manhattan court papers. A number of police...